Good morning, everyone. It's the week. Of, good morning, everyone. It's the week of the twelfth, and oct oh my god. Good morning, everyone. It's October. It's there. Good morning, everyone. So it's the week of October. T good morning, everyone. It's the week of October twelfth. I haven't gotten that far yet. Yay! Hey, I did something right. Now I'm gonna talk to you guys about cheating. So, as you guys can see, Corey and I have made a channel called Ebony and Ivory, inspired by the song done by Stevie Wonder and Paul McCartney. Um, I'm going to be talking to you guys about cheating online, um, and just the different aspects of it, whether it could be uh, it's, it's cheating in a positive way or cheating in a negative way. Now, when, when I say it like that, it all depends on what video game you're playing. Corey just went done talking, went done. Corey just got done talking about the different aspects um, of cheating and like, not cheating, of just online etiquette in um, Halo and in different games. Well, no, he just talked about Halo, but I'm going to expand on that. Today we're going to be talking about glitches and cheating. Now, there's a difference between the two. And I'm talking about, you know, um, let's say you're on a Halo map. Now, I'm not a huge Halo person, so I'm not going to know too much. You're on a Halo map, and you're just walking, you're walking, and you're walking, and then you get boom, headshot out of no, nowhere, and you know, it's boom, headshot every time, and um, you're like, what's going on? And then like, you know, little noobs like, headshot, every time, and you know, you now you notice somehow later in the game, the little noob creep is inside a building, like you know, floating on top of some, something, in the crevice of something. And that would be considered glitching. Is glitching a bad thing? I've looked at several um, forms. I've looked at different people's takes on it. One of the main things that people talk about with glitching is that it's taking advantage of the game engine to use it to your needs with glitches. You're taking advantage of something that, you know, um, something overseen or something that man messed up that the game developers messed up on. Is that a bad thing? No, because that's just in the game. You're not doing anything to modify the game. You're not, you're just making it a little bit more unpleasant. It's morally wrong, is it wrong? Yeah, is it morally wrong? Yeah, but can you do it? And can you, with a clean conscience or not, you know, it's just online gaming. Yeah, sure. I mean, here's the thing. It's like if the bank messed up on like, you know, money or something like, like that. Let's say that the bank put an extra $100 in your bank account by accident. Are you going to take that money or are you going to give it back to the bank? Now, you could take advantage of the mistake that the bank did and keep that $100, um, take out that $100 from your account, withdraw it, and, you know, spend it on, you know, I don't know, DJ Hero that's coming. Now, if you told someone that, you would definitely get mixed reactions, like, oh, that's the bank's fault. Or, you know, it's the bank's fault. You should give that money back. And they would get, and they would be, oh, thank you. I mean, you're not going to get anything back from it. But if it's in your account, yeah, sure, you can do it. If they ask for that money back, they can't because it was their mistake. But then again, it goes, it, it all comes back down to morals. Is it morally right? No. Can you still do it and get away with it? Yeah. So it all depends. Me, for glitching, I think it's just like, like you know, just do it. So yeah, um, that's my video. Um, I really don't have a topic. Um, there are several new games coming coming out. Um, some of my friends are yelling at me for not getting Beatles, Rock Band, Corey. Um, what would you have picked? Would you have picked DJ Hero? Or would you have picked Rock Band? And what's your take on it? Do you think that the current video games that are coming out, which you can do guitars or drums or DJing, for example, are they teaching skills that might be applied to um, real life, or are they just fake knockoffs that really are just destroying um, rock music and the and it makes it look silly? It's making it look crappy. Anyway, that's my video. That's Pierre. I'll talk to y'all later.
thank you for playing.